Hey Spinners and Sharks, Ace of Vegas here. Thanks for joining me on the 1000 subscriber video. Before we actually do the giveaway, I wanted to go ahead and show you my number one seated, undefeated, 10 out of 10 method of getting free upgrades in Vegas when I check in. Let's get started. It's the Ace of Vegas, the Ace of Vegas. Okay folks, before we get this tutorial started, there are a few things you need to know about the $20 technique. Number one, while people may call it a $20 trick, trust me when I say you're not tricking anyone. People have been doing this for years and every hotel check-in clerk has had it happen to them. Number two, be flexible with your upgrade. I've had occasions where I've gotten a linear room upgrade, which is nice. Other times I've gotten a few view upgrades along with food or gambling credits, or even some fees waived like resort fees. As long as your upgrade beats out your initial investment, it's a free upgrade. Number three. The slower the season is, the better the upgrade is. While you may get a nice room upgrade during the weekend in the spring or summer, a good upgrade is more likely during fall or winter, especially during the week as those times are slower. Avoid weeks with major conventions. Number four, feel free to try it with your comps. I've done this every time I stay in Vegas and usually have at least one night comped, typically two or three. Okay, now that that's all out of the way, let's teach you the technique step by step. Step one. Get yourself a Casino Players Club card. You'll notice the link for Players Club cards on the hotel's website when you book. Sign up there and then book. Hotels love their members, even the basic ones, because they'll see you as being more likely to be a recurring source of revenue, and therefore will treat you better. Step 2. Book your hotel online through the hotel's direct website. Third-party booking sites have negative priority, and they don't stack well with comps. If you want an upgrade, booking directly offers the hotel a potentially more loyal customer that the hotel will work harder for. Step 3. When you get your online check-in email from the hotel, ignore it. The website will just charge you for the room upgrade or any other perks. Also, it won't smile at you. Step 4. When you arrive at the hotel and see the self-check-in kiosk, ignore it. It won't accept a $20 bill and will make you pay for any extras. Tell it to go away. Step 5. Prepare a fresh $20 sandwich. The ingredients include your state or federal ID, like a passport or driver's license, a fresh $20 bill from a bank back home or the ATM at the drugstore, your credit or debit card that they'll hold on file for room charges and deposits, and, if you want to make it extra flavorful, garnish it with your Players Club card. Step 6. Get through the check-in line and find a clerk that you like, usually someone who's a little seasoned, but also not jaded. Step 7. Approach with a genuine smile and offer your reservations with the fresh sandwich. Step 8. While your clerk confirms your reservations, ask to see if they have any complimentary or special upgrades available for your stay. If you have an occasion, like your little brother's first time in Vegas, your sister's birthday, your best friend's wedding, or your anniversary, feel free to mention them, but only if that's the real occasion. Step 9. Sit back and make a little small talk while your clerk works. Don't interrupt them, they're busy helping you. Also make it clear that you're not in a rush. It gives them more time to see what they can do, and also the sense that you're not entitled. This makes helping you seem more appealing. Step 10. Once the trick is done, thank them kindly and enjoy your upgrade. They'll usually ask if the $20 bill is for them. Politely confirm and thank them again, then you can head to your room. Now you're free to enjoy your freshly made up room. Thanks for watching this guide. If you enjoyed it, I appreciate a like, and feel free to subscribe to check out my other guides and tutorials. But now, let's move on to the 1000 subscriber drawing. Okay, spinners and sharks, it's time to play Wheel of Names. Yes, that's right, Wheel of Names. That's how we're going to go ahead and decide who the winner of this $100 Cirque du Soleil gift card is, or Hippodrome if you're, if you're Kay Staples, but we're not going to get into that right now. <laughs> what we are going to get into is, uh, we. I just wanted to go ahead and say thank you guys all so much for supporting me and getting me this far. I did some tweets and social media posts where I shouted out all, all the help I got from, you know, guys like my Yugi bros, um, you know, definitely my, my IT fam to my work fam, my home fam and all that all that good stuff too and you know just just all the support i'm getting from you know by even the vegas community too uh you know you got uh chris from faces and aces uh the um the travel fanboy and that guy's great the comps guy chris rocks um and, and you know just so many so many good people helping me out here and i'm i'm getting messages right now just from everybody just supporting me and i'm Really, really excited to be over a thousand subscribers. I know this is a little late because by the time I announced it, I was already at 1,100 subscribers, and now I'm coming up on 1,200. So I'm guessing I might have to plan the next video. Oh, I don't know, maybe a 5,000 subscriber giveaway, something crazy like that. We'll we'll do something fun. I'll 
I'll do the next milestone as something really, really big. But until in the meantime, I just wanted to go ahead and read just a couple comments from the Devin and Dell video where I told everybody to enter. Um, that's how you guys got your entries here. I'm only going to go over a couple of them. I think there are about 22 of them in total, and it would take me a little while to go ahead and get through them, and that would make the video really long. I did read, and I think I got a response on all the comments too and i just enjoyed them all it really made me made me re feel really good so we'll just go ahead and do like uh i don't know like five of them or so and we'll just go ahead and go from there uh first one i'm gonna read is from ismael 8907 used to be despacito oof and i heard the despacito song with the roblox oof so uh, oof sound effect if you ever wondered about that bro just fyi um but what he said was yo ace best video you've ever done was the top 10 best hotels in vegas and that seemed to be a very popular sentiment uh, amongst the contest and amongst people i think that's my most popular video of all time and i think it's really kind of the reason that a lot of people lately have discovered me so i'm really glad i'm uh, really thankful for that and i'm really thankful for ismael he's definitely he's o pretty much always the first on the scene when i drop a new video he's got those notifications on and he's always got uh, something to contribute to the conversation so you know shout out to my boy right there um let's see another good one that i really love because you know we got mari cynthia oh yeah here's another good one from julian over here i really like this one it says hey ace so watched your video how to play my vegas slots 2018 and then it all began i got a bit addicted and checked the my vegas app and the my vegas facebook app every morning now i'm at a million gold coins and i planned a trip to vegas in september only through your videos i became aware of it so a thousand thanks for your work i hope your channel will reach even more people out there thanks for all the good content thank you julian um yeah addicted yeah i don't want to get anyone addicted to slots or anything like that but i'm glad that you're it, it, you know i think that was an anecdotal sort of thing so i'm glad that you're enjoying the games and that you've made so many chips and that you actually get to enjoy a great vacation so i'm lo really looking forward to that there so that's that's a good thing i can't wait to hear about your uh, your vacation when you come back in september now uh, let's see got another good one from glamby clint holder had a good one there's my boy the comps guy over there i uh, don't forget to get i hit the mic i <laughs> uh, don't forget to go shout out my boy the comps guy over here too because he does some really similar stuff to me so if you guys like what i do um especially the best slots in vegas series is a good guy to go ahead and talk about um and he does do the hashtag vegas, vegas podcast with me too so um oh here's a fun one from all right so carlos got got a good one top 10 um let's see uh tom really liked all, oh here's a good one from uh diane too podcast on 728 informative and laugh my butt off we picked on diane a little bit we talked about uh watching tv so to speak and had a blast with that so that was a good time um here's another one i really do like from airsoft blaine i think the my vegas blackjack vid was my favorite it was the first one i watched love hearing about these like uh these nostalgic videos too uh, matt's got a good one too about the mirage buffets uh pop-up fishing uh, one of my favorite blackjack players over here, Pop Up, loves the blackjack videos. I wish the game still paid off for us. It was nice while it lasted. Congrats on the thousand subs, and I hope you will be able to take the channel to new heights. I hope so too. And you know, if it wasn't for you, because uh, Pop Up Fishing actually gave me a mad shout out in the Vegas group that we're both in over here. Uh, he won like something like six hundred thousand chips playing blackjack the way that we'd been playing blackjack, and just killed it. And you know, we had like thirty or forty people jump on the channel and subscribe and start like binge watching the videos the same day. And hopefully that's really helped out hopefully if a few of you folks were uh involved in that you know you can go ahead and shout out pop-up fishing too because that guy's great love this guy over here uh let's see got one from rachel nice one from rachel nice one from jerry uh let's see michelle favorite is the ranking one over here uh, uh let's see got k staples over here shouting out the two billion chip reward video uh, Justin talking about the favorite hotel. Yeah, the, the hotel lists seem to be really, really popular there, too. Um, oh, here's a here's another one I really wanted to read. Uh, Veronica, uh, congratulations on your 1,000. I'm fairly new to the channel. You make Vegas look like fun again. I haven't been in many years. The Riviera was the place that I always stayed. Watching your videos has inspired me to take a trip sometime next year. Thanks. And, you know, that's great, too, especially uh, with Veronica being a Riviera fan. I'm not sure if you guys know, but the Riviera Hotel and Casino, one of the oldest on the Strip, it was on the north end where it was struggling a bit. The The hotel was doing great, but it got demolished, and it was replaced by a parking lot, and it's, like, one of the biggest travesties. That's the origins of the Crazy Girls show. You know, uh, I'm not sure if you guys have seen that statue with all the showgirls, like the big bronze one, and, you know, they, you know, they got the butts out and everything like that. That's, uh, that's where that came from. That was the Crazy Girls' topless show, one of the first ones in Vegas, if not the first one in Vegas uh, on the strip there. So, yeah, that, that was a really cool one, too. Um, and then, yeah, we got Dan coming in. Uh, 
Gruston Trill, and our striker coming in too. So we got you guys all in the wheel of names over here. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and load everybody in right now. Let that load. And then we will let fate decide who the winner is. So I'm going to go ahead and click. And let's get that one spin on the clock. On your marks, get set, ready, and go. So Carlos, looks like you are the big winner, my man. Um, so you know how to get a hold of me. I'm going to go ahead and comment on this video too, uh, and I'm going to leave my social media links. Uh, I'd probably say that Twitter or Facebook's the easiest way to get a hold of me. I'm on those the longest. Um, alternately, Instagram is good too. But yeah, let me go ahead and get together with you, get your contact info. Let's go ahead and get you that gift card. And also, thank you so much, man, for backing me up. Thank, thank all of you for interacting and just you know sharing the video around, telling people about it. Uh, I've, I've had such a such a good time. I didn't think I'd ever have any amount of success on YouTube like this. It was just something I kind of started doing for fun and thought, oh, you know, maybe one of these days I'll, I'll roll over a certain amount of subscribers, maybe be able to self-finance uh, some of the trips and all that. And, you know, the, the response has just been tremendous and I've gotten so much support. So thank you guys all so much for everything that you've done. I'm going to make uh, the rest of this year is really going to be popping. I've got some really big plans for uh, season three. So next January going out through the year. Uh, I might, might take a couple weeks off towards the end of December. I got a big December trip. I'll, I'll probably end the season with that. Uh, the Christmas trip, maybe take a week or two off and then we'll go into January really strong. So looking forward to that. Uh, until next time, my friends, Ace of Vegas is signing out. Strong hands, happy spinning. Carlos, hit me up, brother. All right, peace out.